Hi, my name is Dr. Dorothea Olchul, and I'm the director of neurointerventional surgery at Neurosurgeons of New Jersey. What is tinnitus? It's the perception of a sound without any external source. There is one special category that is a pulsatile tinnitus, which is a rhythmic sound with the heartbeat. And while there are 50 million Americans living with a sound, there are only about five to 10 percent of people who have that special category of the pulsatile sound. They can hear it in one ear or in both ears, and it can be low pitched, like shoo, 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 or high pitched, and that is important information to know what kind of a sound it is because the treatments may vary depending on the sound. The good news is that most pulsatile tinnitus is actually not a dangerous condition. All of these conditions that I was talking about are actually treatable. So while many people may have been told that they have to live with their pulsatile tinnitus, actually with a careful evaluation and examination, about 70% of all pulsatile tinnitus cause can be determined. And once a cause is determined, it's potentially also treatable. The whole procedure is about half an hour. Um, and we monitor the patient in the hospital. Usually they can't get up for about two hours after the procedure. And if everything is okay, either later that day or next day, they go home and can recover at home. Most people can return to work within two days, unless they do something like heavy weight lifting or very physically active work, then they may wait um, a couple of days are longer, about a week or so. If the procedure is successful, the noise is pretty much gone immediately. After they wake up, we can say that about over 90% of our procedures are successful to um, get rid of the noise.